Hey y'all, welcome back to the Pink Envelope. I have a brand new to the channel box. This is Desk Stash, y'all. Office supplies. We love office supplies in this family. And so we are, ooh, dare I say it, starting to prepare for back to school. I, I like literally feel like we just got out of school. But if you don't start about a month in advance, it's really difficult to get what you need. So I told the girls, even though they have a pretty set school list, we're gonna splurge on some fun things to sneak in in certain spots. Desk stash is good for that because what they can't use, I will use here in the Pink Envelope office. It is a subscription box for fans of unique office supplies, which I know there's a few of us in this group who love cute, fun, chic office supplies. All the details about this box are down below, but it's quarterly, about $45, but they offer prepaid discounts. Shipping varies. I got a coupon code P15 for 15% off your first box in a subscription or 15% off your annual subscription. Um, I've loved everything I've seen about this box. I haven't seen what's in this one, but the quality is good. When I was kind of sneaking on them, the reviews from other people are good. So this might be a really great one for us to put into our lineup because you can have it shipped to your home office, your work office, for your kiddos. It's very flexible. And I am very happy to say Desk Stash is offering to host a giveaway here on the channel. So to enter to win your very own Desk Stash box, you must like this video, subscribe to my channel, and then tell me a really weird story that happened at work. And if you're a stay-at-home mom, you're gonna have the best weird at work stories because kids are crazy. So tell me a story, cause this can be at home or office about your line of work, uh, what happened, you can say, you can make up names if you need to, if you don't want to <laughs> blow the whistle on anyone. And I figure the comments will be full of really good laughs for this video. Fine print, you must be over the age of 18 to enter to win, and you must live in the United States. Also, watch out for spammers. When I reply to your comments, I will say, congratulations, your name. You have won the desk stash box. Please email me at, and I'll put it there, and I follow that same format every time. It is from this channel. It's not from WhatsApp. It's not from a text message. I'll never ask you for money. And then once you email me, I will ask for proof that you are who you are. You can send me the email that uh, YouTube sends you when we exchange comments, some kind of proof because the scammers have been coming after me and they're pretending to be you trying to get me to ship the winnings to a fake person. So we're gonna set up some parameters for some accountability because I still wanna do giveaways because I think they're a lot of fun. Okay, let's see what's in this puppy. I know it comes with five to seven unique office supplies and each box has about an $80 value. You pay $45 or less per quarter. Little info about the box and who they are. This is not a spoiler, so you have to worry. Uh, itemized of what's in the box, we'll look at that in just a minute. I'm already seeing some like old school typewriters. Is that what I'm seeing here? And look at the back. Let's pop this open. Okay, it says there are luxury writing papers and there are several papers here. Very old school. A keepsake folder, which is this guy here. So we'll put our papers in there. I'm gonna tell you right now, my oldest will love this. And then there are some A4 envelopes. So there's 10 envelopes and there's 10 papers. So I've shared with y'all before that my kiddos have pen pals. And a few of you have asked like, how in this day and age do they have real traditional paper pen pals? We actually support a few different kids through Compassion International. And it is a group who connects us here with people over there and those here and there vary based on where you're located. Um, with children, I think the ages of 18 and under is kind of how the rules work, uh, where you can fund them to make sure they can go to school, to make sure they have food, toys, and all of those basic needs. What's really, really cool is you can write them, like you get to know them. It's really a cool ministry. Um, gosh, I've been supporting kids and writing pen pals at Compassion since I was the same age as my girl. So we're talking, what, 
page is nine. I just turned 39 for 30 years now. We've been supporting kids over there. If you wanna look into it, I have linked them down below. I'm not getting paid to say this. They have no idea I'm mentioning this. Just the last few times that I've mentioned, we use these things to write our pen pals. You guys have said, where did they come from? So I thought I would shout that out here. Okay, so here's where we get into a few more of the office supplies. We've got really cool looking staples, standard staples in super fun colors. Absolutely going to lose those to my kids. We got a stapler. I don't know about you guys, but we go through staplers. Like I have two over there. I might even have a couple in here, like varying sizes. They either don't work or I don't know what type of staples to buy to refill them because they're like weird kitschy staplers, not like traditional staplers. I'm sure if I spent enough time just sitting still, I could figure it out. But I'm pretty stoked to have a brand new stapler. It's a chic matte color. They put, <laughs> of course, they're an office supply box. They put sticky dots on the base of everything so it sticks in the box and it doesn't shuffle all around, which is pretty stinking brilliant. However, I keep forgetting there's sticky dots on them and I'm sticking my supplies to everything, like, like hardcore look. They're like the hardcore super sticky dots. All right, but of course I'm gonna pull out this pinkish purple. Ooh, I love it so much. Okay, man, my kids are gonna super, super love this. And because I already know someone's gonna ask like, isn't that annoying on the back? No, literally get your thumb and roll like this. It comes off, so it's not like a permanent. So look, it doesn't leave a residue. So anything that's got the sticky on it that you wanna take it off, just roll it with your thumb, it'll pop right off. Okay. Great start. <laughs> Bowling is one of the oldest and most popular sports in the world. So it's about time we honored it with a set of fun, unique push pins. Very, very cute. Both of my kids have marker boards in their rooms, and so this is super, super appropriate. And if you're looking for like ways to organize moving into the school year, I have found that kids who don't like checklists, kids who don't like all of the organization to-do type things, when you incorporate fun things like this, their attitude about it changes a little bit. So like super cute. They could set it up however they wanted, bowling ball, Pins, super easy, yet to a kid, super, super fun. Splendid pin fountain pen plus three blue ink cartridges. So this is this guy here. I'm gonna pop it open so we can take a peek. So I'm only a few items in, but the quality on everything is great, which is tricky because we've opened a few of these like self-care or motivational or women in business or whatever type boxes. And although the stuff is cute, it's cheap, it breaks, it doesn't work. And like all of these things, the quality, the paper quality is outstanding, um, are great. The pen would be like the first real big test because I feel like we always struggle with pens, but this one looks great. It has like this, the true tip, like the calligraphy type tip. Oh no, like what in the world am I doing wrong? Hold on. Okay, so I got on their website because I legit can't figure out how to use this, but I'm determined to. It's a retail value of $7. It has 35 out of five star reviews on this exact pen. And it does say you can remove your ink cartridge, soak the nib, which is the base here, in hot water, dry it, replace the ink, uh, ink cartridge, and start writing, and that's how you keep it from globbing up. I have a sneaky suspicion this gray piece is not supposed to be here, but I don't know how to remove it. And I don't want to break anything, you know what I mean? Stop, there's a YouTube video. How Before to use you your pen. Your fountain pen. You'll need to insert the ink cartridge by snapping it in. Okay, folks, we got it. Okay, super glad we're having this little family chat. The ink cartridge that was in there was actually in there upside down. So I took it out, turned it around, pushed it down until I heard it pop, like the video said. At that point, I saw the ink release. Then I had to tighten this on top. I started writing and it still wasn't working. So I put the lid on and shook it. And that is what released the ink. And now it is working and writes beautifully. So if you get your pen, you're like, what the heck? It's not working. It actually is. 
it just, you can go to their website. It has great information, great YouTube videos, everything uh, on how to clean, use, write with, all the things on the pen. I'm actually really excited to have found this brand. I have a feeling the kids and I are gonna have a lot of fun with it. Okay, super cool. We have chatted about this before, but the, one of the great things about getting these subscription boxes is you get to meet and try new products without this like massive commitment. They send you a pen. If you like it, then you can hop online and order more. It's really, really cool. Okay, we've got more. What is this guy? A mini clipboard and notepad, retail value $13. We love clipboards around here. So it's just a color block clipboard and a notepad. Very cute. We use these quite often. My kids play like school or they play office and these get used, but I mean, quite literally, I have a stack right here, look of scrap papers and notepads that I use every single day. So if the kids don't take this from me, I'll slide it down there. And then last but not least, monograph report cover A4 office essentials. Ooh, this looks so official. Oh, do they just hold papers? Like it's a like a file folder, but way, way cooler. One, two, three, four, five of them. And look at them, like look at the colors on these. They're gorgeous. I'm not gonna say they're waterproof, but they're definitely a plastic that would protect. These are super cool. Makes me feel super office official with these. Okay, so I went through, pulled out my nifty pen and wrote the values of each of these items as I found them online. The one thing that might be a little bit tricky is this stationary set. I just went to Etsy and got the average price for a set of 10 with envelopes matching all the same specs. So my value if I went out is $81 plus tax plus shipping. This box we paid what for? $45 and they said they guarantee at least a retail value of $80. So that was pretty stinking spot on. I know that we will use all of these things in practical life, both between our office and the kids at school. Now my husband and I each own our own companies. Then we have two kids and we literally as a family often play like grocery store or pet sitting where we use these things as well. So my family will get a great use out of it. And I know there are others like us. And I think this makes a great office gift. So, you know, when you're at the office, like gift exchange, or maybe you've got a boss that like, you know, what kind, what do you buy them? This could be a really cool option at quarterly four times a year, a group of you could go in and buy an entire year really easily. Or you could just send a single box if you wanted to, or maybe you just want to treat yourself. The office can get really, really mundane if we're using the same old boring things. So I think splurging on some really cute, fun stuff, discovering new products, or simply just a swapping out your ugly, weird stapler you picked up at Walmart for something that's a little more geometric and matte in shape and color, plus a pink staple can change the atmosphere of the space you're in. Once again, we, as we said, my family and I, we love office supplies, but if you're finding yourself in a rut, I would challenge you, even if you don't do desk dash, it's like the box itself, to just go get a little something to spruce your space. That's why you'll always see me swapping this wall out. I love to spruce my space. It makes it feel so fresh and neat. Um, this is only my first interaction with these guys. I love what I see, but I don't make a full evaluation till we hit three boxes because that gives me the ability to see what they do across an entire quarter. But if you want to check these guys out, I do have the URL below, a coupon code below. And if you are a current subscriber, lean in and tell us what your thoughts are. Have you subscribed? What were your interactions? What type of products did you get? And of course, don't forget to enter the giveaway. Okay, you guys, we have so much on the calendar. We've got a big announcement regarding my second surprise coming up. We've got Stitch Fix Kids with Tryon, book subscriptions. Um, ben and Sabrina have some Wantable coming. They have Stitch Fix coming. We have a Mittens Haul coming, Fall Steal It box, Robert and Wallace Fall, and then we'll be launching my big surprise. I'm hoping early August. So you want to subscribe to the channel to make sure you're not missing anything. I am dropping hints on both Instagram and Facebook 
and YouTube uh, up until the big announcement of what I'm going to do. I hope that you guys are having an absolute blessed I'm not day. Sure I understand. Man, I thought we had it. I hope you guys are having an absolutely blessed day. And if you subscribe to the channel, I'm going to see you guys later. Bye, y'all.